My name is Darren Headley, I uh, run Punch Hub Chino. We've been up and running for the best part of uh, heading into two years now. Works brilliantly for me, it's really easy to log people in. Um, so literally five minutes before class starts, log people in, get them up and running. Um, you've got a competitive element within a class, so obviously people can be competitive with themselves against other people with a class, or people are sometimes competitive against their own best scores, so they kind of know what their overall power score was, and they may try and beat that. So they can be competitive either with themselves or with other members of the, uh, of the class. Definitely. So I, I was saying earlier that sometimes I can, when I take part in a class, sometimes I might feel a bit tired and I just think, oh, you know, I'll go through the motions a little bit today. Generally 20 minutes in, I'm looking up at the scoreboard and I'm thinking I'm not having them beating me. And, you know, I suddenly pick my own game up. So, you know, it works both for me and for everyone else. And, you know, you, it's not even if you're top, second, third or whatever, people in seventh place want to beat the person in sixth place. So, you know, the fact that they move around like a grid I find that really helps. So we have it on the grid setting so your scores are, are moving and I find that really helps people. Yes, so for instance, I won't name her, but there was a lady at class today who guaranteed at some point on social media today, will look up the last time we did this class and my classes are all named after boxers and there's like 17 different classes. So today's class was De La Hoya. She will look up the last time that she did De La Hoya and at some point on social media today, she will share her last score and her new score. One thing I love about it is that it works on traditional boxing, i.e. if you throw bad punches, it won't count it. You know, so it is actually, the trackers are effective for boxing, but also, you know, it's, it's just get, getting people into a different form of, form of sport. The fact that you will lose weight, you're going to exercise, you're going to get stronger, you're going to get fitter. It's almost as important that people get their frustrations out. They're coming to a class that they enjoy. So the first thing is, if you're doing a class, enjoy it. If you enjoy it, you're likely to come back and you're likely to stick to it. Always really try and encourage people to get the app immediately. Their first class, I want their data on. Because if they've got the data for the first class, and then they look back in two months' time, the improvements are leaps and bounds. Whereas, you know, if you don't get the app, some people say, oh, I'll get it next week, I'll get it next week. And I'm like, just get the app. Because the quicker you get it, the quicker you're going to see that massive exponential improvement almost over particularly the first two months. So, you know, that's, that's quite, a big, quite a big part. And class today, one, two, three, there were four people in the room who have done over 100 classes because um, I give them a t-shirt once they've done 100 classes. Now, considering we started in January 2020 and we've been locked down for half of that, the fact that I've had four people in a class of 12 who have actually attended 100 times speaks volumes for the class, the software, everything.